The Me Too movement exposed some long-hidden abuses by powerful individuals in Hollywood and beyond. But there's also another, more radical side of Me Too, seen in the slogan, Believe All Women. Among the accused was Alec Klein, a former Washington Post reporter and journalism professor at Northwestern University. When you feel your whole life is uh, collapsing on itself. Klein would become one of the many who were found guilty not by a court of law, but in the dubious court of cancel culture. I actually had fewer rights than if I had been accused of murder. In the age of Me Too and cancel culture, what has become of due process? This is American Thought Leaders, and I'm Yanya Kellick. So you've just watched a clip from an American Thought Leaders interview, and as you probably know, I pour my heart and soul into these. YouTube has been censoring some entirely mainstream videos lately, including things like Florida Governor DeSantis's coronavirus roundtable. We've even had some of our own videos removed from YouTube for no clear reason whatsoever. And frankly, I don't find this to be appropriate. I don't find this to be acceptable. I don't want to be sitting around thinking what YouTube may or may not feel like they want to censor. And beyond that even, YouTube has demonetized us for the past two months. Ostensibly, we're working to resolve the issue, but our hopes are kind of fading when it comes to this. So what is our response to this? Well, we've started our own platform, Epoch TV. Now, Epoch TV is the premium Epoch Times video platform. It's got American thought leaders, but it also has The Larry Elder Show and Crossroads with Joshua Phillip and a number of other programs. So you can get Epoch TV for this low introductory rate of $4.99 a month. And in so doing, you're actually supporting the Epoch Times as an organization. You're supporting uncensored news. You're supporting groundbreaking investigative reporting. And you're supporting these deep dive interviews that I love doing so much. Please join us.